Okay, this is a companion video to my video review of the Dymo Label Maker, which they call the Dymo Label Manager. This is the unit that takes the D1 replacement cartridges. This is going to show you how to open the back of the unit to replace the cartridge. It's super simple. There's a little tab here at the top. You can put your fingers under it. It comes right open. This cartridge is still active, so I'm not going to put in a new one, but I'll show you. You just lift it. Super easy. They come like this. You can see the edge of the tape on there for the labels. All you do is line it up right here, push it down. That's it. Okay? It'll feed itself through here when you make a label. I have had it jammed two or three times, usually after my five year old has made a label. Yes, my five year old can make labels on it, it's that easy to use. So, all you do if it jams, you'll see it get caught up in here. What I do is I just lift it up, chop it off so it's about about this length, but not below. You don't want it to go behind these little holders right there. Then you just reinstall it, like so. Close the back until it clicks. You're ready to go. Just turn it on. And there it is, ready to make another label. It senses that it was removed, so it's asking you the width. I always use the D1s in half an inch, 23 feet long, half an inch wide. I select half an inch, OK. That's the last label I just made. So, And that's how you open it up and change your cartridge.